to which we can further push this lens into the anterior chamber. Then we can direct this haptic into the sulcus. We have many ways to direct this haptic into the sulcus, either by rotation of the lens or can just do flexion of the haptic by a Sineski or Coglin hook. And here, the step that I always like is to do the optic capture. So as you can see now, the lens is above the rexis. What I'm going to do is to push the optic behind the rexis. So one part, and this is the other side. Now we have a successful optic capture. And this further enhance the stability of the lens for these cases of compromised, compromised lens capsule stability or compromised zone. As you can see now, the Rex is, is turned to be elliptical in shape and we have now pretty stable lens thanks to the optic capture while implanting the lens into the sulcus. So you can see that the lens is pretty well centered thanks to the optic capture. Big mops. This is preserved to free moxifloxacin to be injected inside the eye just before conclusion of the surgery. The pressure is fine and the wounds are self-sealed. Thank you very much for watching.